Hello and welcome to Soju Society, where today we'll be making somek, which is beer and soju, with Heineken and Good Day pomegranate. I feel like the slight, only slight bitterness of the Heineken with the a little bit tartness of the pomegranate is going to go good together. I feel like they usually make it with pretty pale beers. Uh, like Haitu and Kasu are the ones that I know I'm really familiar with. Very light lager type of drinks. I think very little, little hop. Little, little hop? Little hop. We recently learned that Heineken bottles have, the E is a smiley E. It's like, that's oh. designed so that it looks like it's smiling at you. I can also see it like, is it like laughing? Ha <laughs> ha. Yeah, yeah, it's leaning back a little bit. Ha <laughs> ha. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> Sumek is beer with a drop shot of soju. Mm. So, so comes from soju and mek comes from mekju, which means beer. Uh, Koreans, usually you make somek with original soju and a light beer that like, like we talked about that comes out of Korea. Uh, so this will be interesting to see what kind of fruit beers, I mean, fruit sojus go with what kind of beers. So mm. I'm excited for this series. So let's do this. Okay, we're going to be using these cups, which are a cup, a full cup, 250 milliliters, and a half a shot of soju. I think normally it's about a sleeve of beer with a full shot, so we're doing mini ones right here. Let's do it! So I'm going to the line. Going to the line. Oh, but then when we throw it, it's going to overflow when we drop it in. That's true. But that's cool. <laughs> Okay, I have to, I think I might have to wait a minute. How did you do it so perfectly? Okay, okay. How did I pour so badly? That's, that looks right. <laughs> Is this gonna dump on my lap? <laughs> I thought you have to start with it upside down. Yeah, and then... Okay, I'm gonna do it. Okay, do it. Just make sure it's flipped. Oh, I'm weak. <laughs> Am I tightening it? Right way? No, I'm not. Lefty Lucy. <laughs> <laughs> I need some practice on that one. <laughs> I love when the bubbles come up uniformly like that. It's like. Gee, 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 gee. Oh. 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 <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. This is so nice. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, come on. I've been waiting to start filming <laughs> for a long time. <laughs> That's a good mixture. The pomegranate was a good choice. Okay, the way that this cup is designed, the shot glass gets trapped. Yeah. So then it's like super tasty all the way up to here. And then as soon as you start getting the bottom part, it's more bitter. So it like starts with sweet and then ends with bitter. These are the wrong cups. Also, how much of the soju spilled <laughs> onto the counter? <laughs> <laughs> but the first, I love the first, like this much. I guess with regular somek, it's a higher percentage soju, right? It's like 16.9 or oh, something yeah, like that, true. whereas this is 13. Yeah, So 13.5? Yeah. It's cool. It's cool. <laughs> like, like getting the flavor difference of when you first taste it with the soju, it's like sweet and fruity and it's like a very easy entrance into it. And mm. then right at the end as you're like yeah so maybe it's good with these cups then. so success success this is a good combo heineken and good day pomegranate soju mm -hmm. we'll see what happens next time we're gonna do guinness and blueberry thank you for coming to soju society see you next time like and subscribe if you have a idea of a combination we should use so thank you i'm Jiyoon. i'm michael 